The travel experience to the islands of the Bahamas is about to become even easier as the government is embarking on the construction of new airports in Edzuma, North Eleuthera and Long Island. Obviously we're, we're planning um, infrastructure upgrades within our, within our airport uh, portfolio. The government owns 28 family island airports. We're hoping to start the construction of Exuma Airport this year. Uh, we're actively looking at airports in, in Long Island, Edmonds Key and uh, north of Ultra. Minister Diaglo says one of the main focuses of the Ministry of Tourism and Aviation this year is ensuring that visitors to the islands of the Bahamas receive a world-class travel experience. We have to ensure that uh, LPIA continues to um, to perform under those those conditions. So even this morning I met with all of the stakeholders down at the airport whether it be the air traffic controllers, whether it be uh, Nassau Airport Development Company, the operator of the airport, the, the, the fixed-based operations down there, Odyssey and Executive Aviation. So seeing how we can better uh, um, uh, improve the customer experience, because I was, I, there were a couple of days there where we would, that we did not perform well. So we have to figure out and learn from those experiences to see how we can uh, ensure that all of our foreign visitors here are having an, uh, an optimal experience. Last year, the government tapped into a new source of touristic income by signing an agreement with three major African countries, the Netherlands and Turkey. These agreements govern airline operations to the Bahamas. I'm Candia Smith and this is Tourism Today.